Department of Infrastructure, Ports and Transport joins the rest of the world in observing November as Road Safety Awareness Month. Despite the many interventions undertaken worldwide, the safe use of our roads remains a very serious public health concern. As a small island, still developing state, St. Lucia continues to grapple with the effects and impacts of road collisions, crashes, and very regrettably fatalities. The increase in the number of motor vehicles on our roads also increases the level of exposure to collision, frustration with traffic congestion, and road rage. Road traffic deaths and injuries have become very high prices to pay for mobility. Managing driver behavior and taking personal responsibility therefore remains the primary tool for reducing collisions and fatalities. Operating the vehicle with caution, wearing your seatbelt, not being distracted by mobile phones, being attentive to road signs, not driving while intoxicated from drugs or alcohol, using child restraints and motorcycle helmets, and the proper application of driving codes and principles are all fail-safe measures that when consistently applied by all road users, especially drivers, can prove effective. Pedestrians and cyclists are also required to exercise their share of responsibility in using the roads. Wearing reflective clothing can increase visibility when walking or cycling. Preventative vehicle maintenance, especially on braking systems, tire wear and other potential mechanical failures are just as important when venturing out onto the road network. Functional wiper blades, appropriate headlamps and even horns should not be discounted when operating a motor vehicle. Ensure that your vehicle is serviced as prescribed by the manufacturer at an approved garage. For our part, the Department of Infrastructure has the mandate to provide safe, resilient road infrastructure. This includes motorable road surfaces, road furniture such as crash barriers, adequate street lighting and road signs. Section 74 of the Motor Vehicles and Road Traffic Act makes it an offense for a person to drive a motor vehicle on a road without due care and attention or without consideration for other road users. This offense carries a fine on summary conviction, not exceeding $2,000 or to imprisonment for a term not exceeding six months or to both. Section 73 of the Motor Vehicles and Road Traffic Act commits a person who causes death of another person by dangerous driving or drives dangerously on any road on summary conviction, on indictment, to imprisonment for a term of not less than five years and not exceeding 15 years. These penalties in no way provide compensation for the loss of life or limb or the trauma and socioeconomic hardships endured by the victims of road traffic incidents. The power to save a life, especially your own, is in your hands. Use the roads wisely.